welcome back to my channel and today I have a humongous haul that I wanted to share with you guys. If you follow me on Instagram at Mechaholic22 or if you follow my sister at The Looks Babe then you would have known that I recently traveled to Paris to celebrate my sister's birthday and also to Germany because that's where my sister lives. So yeah, so you guys know that every time I go to Europe I always, you know, take the opportunity to pick up items, usually high-end items that I've been wanting or that's on my list. So I did just that and I'm gonna share them with you guys today. Now, because because I have so many items I don't want this video to be too long so let's just go ahead and get started and I'm gonna start off with my receipts because that can take a long time I'll just show you I have stuff from Saint Laurent I have some Gucci receipts I also have a couple um, Louis Vuitton receipts I have some items from Chanel and also another Saint Laurent um, receipt. I also picked up stuff from Longchamp and you'll see. So let's just get started with Louis Vuitton. Alrighty guys, so the first item I'm going to share with you came in this bag right here and this item is really not mine. I purchased this for my mom as a gift and she still hasn't received it yet. So that works out for me because I can go ahead and share the item with you. So as you can see, the item came in this little box here, cutely packaged, and as you can see, it has the holiday packaging on there, the ribbon, okay? And I already have this item for myself, but my mom always comments on mine, and so I wanted to go ahead and pick one up for her. So this is the item, it comes in this little dust bag here, and you guys probably already guessed what it is. And this is what I picked up and this is the pochette clay it's like a key clay um, you can keep your keys on it you can use it as a small wallet um, you could keep your coins in there whatever you decide but I picked it up in the Damier Eben okay so you guys know what this looks like already and inside it just has a textile card and you guys know that it uh, comes with one of those keychains here that you can go ahead and put your keys on. Alrighty, so the next item that I picked up came in this little bag and this was my first time receiving a little package like this, okay? And the item that I picked up is a fragrance. So this is what the fragrance came in. This is the box. Um, you guys already know what this box looks like. You can see the LV on there. All right, and the fragrance came in this beautiful, um, I would say it's like a canister, you know, and you can see it's very, very beautiful. So unlike the box, it's a little bit more, you know, intricate. And on the top, you can see it has the gold with the LV on the top there. I think that's beautiful. And I'm gonna go ahead and keep this packaging, but I'll throw out the box. And then you guys, this is the fragrance. And a fun fact about this, um, you can go ahead and remove the bottom. And I'm covering up something here because I got my name on it and usually they allow you to put like three initials on there but because my name is only four letters they went ahead and did my whole name on there for me so I thought that was really special so this is the fragrance that I picked up and I don't know if you guys can see it but this fragrance is called Atrape Revs if I'm mispronouncing that feel free to co um, you know correct me in the comments below I don't speak French but I believe it's a trappe Reeves or Revs and it is um, it's translated to Dreamcatcher. so I thought that was really beautiful name for this fragrance so as you can see it's clear it has the name in black and then it has Louis Vuitton um, it's clear and then I went ahead and got my name um, on there in gold so it's really beautiful and I did gold because as you can see the top of it has the LV in black in gold so it just looks really beautiful you guys and the top is magnetic really heavy as you guys can see it snaps on really easily so 
let's get into the notes of this fragrance oh my gosh you guys so I definitely recommend that you guys go ahead and smell this one it's a little on the pricey side but I think that it's worth it and if you can afford this fragrance I definitely recommend that you go ahead and get some samples it's kind of tricky getting a fragrance samples from Louis Vuitton but if you have a good relationship with your essay um, you could go ahead and ask for a few samples so yeah this is beautiful and the notes in this one which what surprised me was the coca powder and I think that's what adds the um, that little special you know note in this fragrance so it has coca powder it has patchouli it also has um, lychee and peonies so you can imagine that lychees peonies patchouli and coca powder it's just a special blend and I believe that this is the best fragrance out of all of them that they have to offer so you guys and I think this is one of the newest ones that they have so I won't spend too much time on this you guys I definitely recommend that you guys check out Atrape Revs it's beautiful and you guys one special thing I forgot to mention about the fragrances at Louis Vuitton it's refillable so I'm really so happy about that because once I'm through with this I can take my bottle in and get a refill and I think you get a percentage off um, your purchase so yeah every time you bring it in for a refill you don't pay like the full price that you would you know initially since I'm on the fragrance train I picked up one more fragrance and because I was in Paris I had to pick up a special fragrance every time I go to Paris I try to pick up a fragrance that I can't get you know within the US or a fragrance that's from um, Paris so anyway um, I went to the store called Javoy it's a perfumery and you guys if you haven't been to Javoy if you can get to Javoy if you're traveling go I they have like the rarest perfumes ever and even ones that you know and love and they just have such a large variety so in Javoy I ended up at this um, this table and it is Alexander J I believe it's called and this store is located at Rue de Castiglione I believe I'm pronouncing that correctly but this is the box of the fragrance that I picked up again this is um, Alexander J and as you can see it's the collector and this fragrance is called morning musk so and I picked up the hundred mil you guys I have no um, Prior to this, I didn't know this perfume house and um, I was just smelling everything I could and I think that's, you know, when you get into fragrances, the most important thing is smelling. I wouldn't just go for brands, just smell until you find that special fragrance. Already I'm talking too much. But anyway, I opened it and it also came in this box, which is separate from the box that it came in. And it's a little gaudy I have to say but yeah so it came wrapped up in some sponge paper so this is the canister of the fragrance again this is by the house Alexander J and it is called morning musk and it has this little um, this little charm on there which makes a lot of noise and you can see it's a little bit gaudy but I absolutely love this packaging it's something special and the scent you guys is just wow it's just beautiful again it's called morning musk I didn't have the chance to look up the notes but I will put them in the bar below if you guys are interested and they have a wide array most of the but all of the bottles looks like uh, this one just in a different color again this is called morning musk and it is beautiful all right you guys let's move on the next place that I went to and this is not in order you guys um, I went to the Longchamp Paris store and this one was actually um, the outlets in La Vallée village and that is a little bit outside of Paris so because I have a few Longchamp um, totes already I have black I have two black ones and I have the one with the black leather and the black bag so beautiful the combination is beautiful and then I have a black with the brown leather already and then I also have um, a brown chocolate brown color 
with the brown leather so this time I wanted something a little bit brighter <laughs> a fun color and I went ahead and picked up this beautiful purple tote you guys it's beautiful I love the brown um, leather and the gold hardware and you guys these lepliage totes are a dream to travel with and I love to take this when I go on like medical conferences or we have like training classes that we have to keep going to and I just love taking these totes with me so I wanted a really pretty color um, just to brighten up the winter and this will be good for spring and also summer so I went ahead and picked this tote up and I'll add it to my arsenal of Le Pliage um, Longchamp totes and I also went ahead and picked up this cosmetic case so I can keep my hand lotion in um, I could keep my lip gloss some mints you know the works um, and so this is what it looks like okay and let me take this out I just have my receipts in there and then it comes with one of these um, little envelopes and yeah it's really nice inside because it has a wipeable inside and I really like that idea just in case I spill any um, of my cosmetics in there I can just go ahead and wipe it out so yeah I thought this was a really beautiful pair so guys while I was in Paris I had to stop by my one of my favorite um, candle stores and it is none other than Diptyque and they had this beautiful um, holiday packaging which I loved um, I didn't pick up any candles because I was worried about my weight and um, my suitcase weight and I can get these items you know in in the US so I just wanted to pick up um, one item and so it came with this little booklet um, and it's just beautiful inside and it came with three cards they look like postcards but it's just cards telling you about the holiday collection that they had and I think the red one was my favorite it's like a almond or a almond apple scent it's called Amande Exquisite and then you guys I just have my receipt here and this tour was located let's see 330 rue Saint Honoré and I remember we went here after I left the rue Camban uh, rue Camban Chanel store anyway this is the item that I picked up it's an accessoire or accessory um, it's a candle accessory I'm really hoping that the lights are not washing out the boxes but I went ahead and picked up the wick trimmer so if you guys love candles or burn candles like myself this tool comes in handy as you can see it has that curved bottom that you can trim the wicks off your candles before you burn them you know to prevent that black smoke and you know it just burns better and lasts longer and I've tried trimming my wick with the standard scissors before and it doesn't work out so well okay guys so we're moving on to Gucci and this is was the packaging for the holiday it's a beautiful blush pink color I love it so much um, you know I love their standard black and white packaging but this just made it a little bit more special so yeah I already opened up um, the ties and you guys let's see and this store I went to was located on uh, 23 Rue Royale okay so that's the Gucci store that I went to and the item that I picked up came in this box you guys probably can already guess what it is just from the box and let's go ahead and open this up okay the top off So excited you guys yay all right you guys so the item that I picked up is a shoe if you can already tell and they come in this uh, dust bags right here and if you guys have ever purchased a Gucci shoe before you know that they come with like a ton of these care cards <sighs> so yeah and then let's open this up and show you what I picked up. All 
right so you guys this is what I picked up and this is the Gucci ace sneakers and if you guys follow me even on YouTube or Instagram then you know that I have the white Gucci aces and it's just like this one it's the same thing only in white so I really wanted this in black and so I went ahead and picked it up and let me just show you the mate All right and this is what it looks like if I can get it together <laughs> so these are what they look like and I love that they have two different colors on the heels I just think it's it makes it so much more special and so yeah I'm really happy that I have the black and this is what the bottom of the sneakers look like and I love these Gucci aces they are really comfortable and so that's why I wanted another color so am I gonna get another one I'm not sure as yet but knowing me I probably will <laughs> so this time though I want something completely different next up from Gucci um, this time this was at Lavalie Village and I went ahead and picked up another scarf from Gucci and um, I already have like a light brown with the chocolate brown it's it's like a dual color and so I really wanted a really pretty color and I thought this fits uh, the bill of what I was looking for it's a really beautiful blush pink color I love it so so much as you guys can see it has a tag here and I just love it because you can wear it in a way that shows both or you can wear it in a way that only shows uh, this side or the more um, simple side so yeah I really like them a lot um, I love the Louis Vuitton scarves but I have one already and it's so easily um, pulled at by your earrings or your watch it gets nicked a lot and so these are a little bit more durable not to say I don't love the Louis Vuitton scarves but these are a little bit more durable and so I wanted to pick up another one so the next store that I went to has to be one of my absolute favorite brands at the moment. I don't know, I've fallen deeply and madly in love with this house and it's none other than Saint Laurent. So I have these huge bags, I have two small items and a huge item that I want to share with you guys. But I believe we visited um, the store that's on Avenue Montagna and then I picked up one of my items at the Galleries Lafayette store. Alright guys, so the next store I went to has to be one of my top favorite stores or brands at this time and it is none other than Saint Laurent. Okay, you guys, I am madly and deeply in love with Saint Laurent. I have so many items on my wish list and I just have to take it easy. So anyway, let's show you the items that I picked up. I believe we visited the store on Avenue Montagna and we also went to the one at Galleries Lafayette. So the first item that I picked up, you guys, came in this box. And if you, um, you know, if you love YSL or know about the brand, then you probably can guess the item that I have in here. And the item comes in this little dust bag in here. It's black and white, very classic. And it also comes with this little envelope that houses the authenticity card and the care card, I believe. So guys, this is the item that I picked up and it's in this beautiful fuchsia color and this is none other than the monogram card case in grain de poudre embossed leather and it is in fuchsia once again. This is a five card um, holder and it has two on the back, two on the front and then it has a central middle um, slit right here so I really love this I love it with the gold um, the gold YSL on the front it's a really beautiful card case and it's very puffy and soft I just love the leather I can already tell that this will be a long-lasting item and it will hold up well just based on the leather you guys beautiful beautiful so I got this not another one <laughs> 
as you can see I kind of went crazy um, so yeah I'll take that off and this one also has the little envelope with the authenticity um, information and the care information and this one is in the same dust bag but this one has like a tag on there and you guys are you ready so this is the second item that I picked up from YSL and it's the same monogram um, card case in the embossed leather and this one is in the color Eros Red and it is beautiful. I love that this red is a darker tone. It is also, it's like, it has like a bluish undertone to me. They had another one which was called Shine Red I believe and it has more for yellow, orangey undertone and I preferred this one it is a beautiful tone of red and this is beautiful you guys like look at this combination and they have so many uh, other color combinations that I wanted to check out like if you follow my sister um, she has a beautiful blue um, card case with the gold um, the gold hardware and I also saw like a beautiful mimosa yellow one too that I want but I have to slow my roll so yeah I'm really really happy with these two items and so I'll go ahead and share with you the third item that I picked up alrighty you guys so my next item came in this humongous bag <laughs> so yeah let's go ahead and take the box out Ooh, so heavy and this is what the next item came in this huge box right here and let's go ahead and open it pop this off you guys I am so so excited you guys you have no idea how long I've been wanting this <clears throat> so all right let me get rid of the box so guys this is what my item came in this is the dust bag and are you guys ready to see what I picked up ready Oh my gosh, you guys! This is my piece, the resistance. Beautiful, beautiful bag that I've been wanting for so, so long, you guys. Just take a moment to look at it. And this is the envelope large bag in Grain de Poudre embossed leather. Okay, so this is what it looks like. I'm not gonna get into dimensions and anything like that but if you guys want a review of this bag then comment in the bar below and let me know um, you guys so yeah I've been wanting this bag for a really long time it's been on my wish list and I just never got around to getting it and initially I was looking for the um, this bag with the chevron all throughout the bag um, but as I was told it's an older version and they're phasing that out I'm really still in love with it but I really love this one they had one in the galleries Lafayette but I went ahead and got the newer version I thought the combination was stunning and you know I can always go back and try to find one of the smaller ones in a different color maybe with the um, chevron so anyway as you guys can see I got it in the noir or black color with the gold hardware all right, you guys, I was able to dismantle the protective packaging. So this is what it looks like without it on there. And this is what the strap looks like. It's a beautiful yellow gold um, color. And then it has leather on the top hand, the top part that you rest on your shoulders. And you guys, you can either wear it under um, your shoulder like this or you could go ahead and make it a longer strap just like this which is what I intend to do you guys and um, just to show you some more details you guys can see it has like this quilted um, quilted um, leather on the back 
and then on the top it has that envelope shape with the chevron on the top and I just love 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 this combination as you can see it has this piece of leather coming down to where the YSL is it's beautiful and in the back it's a little hard to show you this guys but in the back it has this slit pocket here which is really huge I can keep my cell phone in the back and if you open it you'll see it has right here it has the Saint Laurent Paris and it also has like a leather tag in there that says Saint Laurent Paris it has a snap closure here which still has the blue uh, sticker on it and it's a it's very dark in here so I don't know if you'll be able to see inside the bag it has like this huge zipper pocket on the side and as you guys can see this bag is pretty huge I imagine I can fit a lot in there okay and I just love the black and gold hardware so you guys can see where that tag is down here you can see a leather tag and then it just has the stamp in gold there so this is a beautiful bag and one item that um, one thing that I noticed too on the strap it has Saint, um, Saint Laurent Paris but it's stamped in black so you guys won't be able to see that okay so this is my beautiful large envelope bag in grain de poudre embossed leather so beautiful with the quilting and with the chevron i've been wanting this bag forever so let me go ahead and move on to the next item i don't want to spend too much time on this but if you guys want to see an in-depth like review almost or just giving you the specs on this bag just go ahead and let me know in the comment section all right, you guys, so I have two items left. I know this is a really long video, but bear with me. And I have two items from Chanel. And this is the first item. As you can see, it is in the black bag, um, the black packaging with the camellia on the front. And I picked this item up in Germany um, on the Gotha Strasse uh, Chanel store. And this is one of the last, I, I, I believe I purchased this on my last day. And I was just really looking for something special and I saw it so I picked it up. So let's go ahead and show you. Let's open this together, you guys. Actually, I can go ahead and take it out like this okay so this is what the item came in this little beautiful Chanel box with the camellia on top and let's go ahead and open this together you guys I just love this packaging so beautiful so let's open it together this packaging how beautiful is it so you open it up like this and this is the item that I picked up I finally picked up a Chanel brooch that I've been wanting for so long and so I love this it has the little um, baguettes on there and um, with the diamonds on one side and then on the other side you guys can see it it's so beautiful I'm really happy to have this finally I can go ahead and put it on my sweaters I can wear it on my coats I mean you can do so much with this just to class up your outfit so this is the item that I got it is a Chanel CC brooch in gold and this is like a lighter gold I would say it's not like that dark yellow gold like the um, YSL hardware and as I was speaking about you can see it has a little diamante um, baguette on one side and on the other side is just the gold metal so I love this brooch so so much and the last item that I picked up from Chanel as you guys can see this item came from the Rue Cambon store in Paris and it's 31 Rue Cambon and you guys this is the packaging you get the white bag and as you can see the camellia is so so beautiful it's not like the um, cloth material like the ones they had this one is hard you can hear 
graphite knock on it and then it has this beautiful pale gold color on one side and then the white so it's really really beautiful and you guys this is my item it came in this black um, white box I'm sorry and in the bag they threw so many camellias well I guess like three camellias in there so you guys can see I have all these extra camellias that they put in the bag and on my packaging I also got one of those smaller camellias on there so I hope you guys can see it and the light isn't washing it out so yeah so let's open this together So this is the box with the ribbon off and that's what it looks like inside and I can already see I think this may be my okay and maybe like the care cards this came inside okay guys are you ready to see what I picked up open it and this is what I picked up you guys. I'm so happy finally finally I have a Chanel card case that I've been wanting in my collection for a long long time. So this is the Chanel CC card case and it is in the caviar leather and it has the light gold hardware. Well this one seems a little bit more yellow I think so yeah. It has the gold hardware on the front. It still has that little um, sticker, blue sticker over it because of course I just opened it up for you guys. I haven't seen this since it was shown to me in the store. And I believe this one also has, let's see, one, two, three. This one has four card um, slats, slots, okay? So in the back you can see, let me take this out. Okay, so as you guys can see, it has the two card slots in the back. On the front, it has one. And then in the middle, you can see it has that central pocket. And here it has my authenticity card. Okay, so I'm super happy. And then on the inside, it just has that burgundy um, shade of color inside the burgundy leather which I think it's so so beautiful you guys so let me go ahead and put my authenticity card back in and yeah so this is my Chanel CC card case you guys I love it it's very poofy just like the YSL and I love the caviar leather so guys that's it for all the items or all the high-end items that i picked up while i was in europe um i had such a wonderful time in paris with my sister and her hubby my brother-in-law and also my sister's friend we had the most amazing time in paris and also in germany i had such a great time with my sister we did so many activities and we just hung out and you know spend time with each other you guys know that i live in the u.s and she lives in Germany so every time we get to see each other um, we just make you know make it special and make the most of it and my sister also got the chance to come back to the US with me um, when my trip ended so we we had additional time with each other so it was the best time ever so anyway you guys thank you so much for watching my video hopefully it makes sense and I know this is a long video but I hope you were able to get through it and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. If you have any questions, put it in the comments below. And I will see you guys in another video. Bye, guys.